the study measured and modeled carbon dioxide, energy, and water fluxes in a fresh clear-cut surrounded by a mixed spruce birch aspen forest in the boreal zone of European Russia using eddy covariance and a process-based two-dimensional, 2D, hydrodynamic turbulent exchange model. The study found that the clear-cut was a source of CO2 to the atmosphere prior to onset of vegetation growth during early spring, with mean daily latent, LE, and sensible, H, heat fluxes being very similar and the Bowen ratio, beta equals HLE, averaging about 1.0. Daily net ecosystem exchange of CO2, NEE, was around 0 GCM 2D1 following onset of vegetation growth from mid-spring through summer while beta declined to 0.6 to 0.7. The study also found strong diurnal variability in NEE, LE, and H over the measurement period that was governed by solar radiation and temperature as well as the leaf area index, LAI, of regrown vegetation. Modeled vertical CO2 and H2O fluxes along a transect that crossed the clearcut and coincided with the dominate wind direction showed that the clearcut strongly influenced turbulent fluxes within the atmospheric surface layer, while modeled atmospheric dynamics suggested that the clearcut had a large influence on turbulent fluxes in the downwind forest but little impact on the upwind side. The study concludes that an aggregated approach including field measurements and process-based models can be a useful approach to estimate energy, water, and carbon dioxide fluxes in non-uniform forest landscapes. This article was authored by V. Mamkin, J. Kerbatova, V. Avilov, and others. We are article.tv, links in the description below.